putting in work. We got the shake from Elegant. Let's go. Game one starting up. The run back. Spargo's going to have to take two sets off of Elegant if he's going to win this tournament. Up he out of shield. I mean, <laughs> it's so funny because right. Elegant, Elegant just goes and tries to shark with an up air and then gets punished with an up out of shield. Yeah, hitting Cloud's shield uh, is not that good of an, an idea, especially because uh, Sparza is just really good at uh, pressing a B right, out, right after something hits a shield. Yeah, and it does 20% too. That's a uh, good like amount that. of percent. Yeah, getting grabbed by Luigi at zero is not a good idea. <laughs> That's the worst thing you can get. Yeah, yeah. you have to play anti-grab first. Wow, Cross is not going to kill. Luigi literally kissed the blast one right there. All right, just playing safe right now. I mean, honestly, that's what Spartago should be uh, looking to do. A lot of these backers, uh, retreating backers, those are going to be very hard for Luigi to, to press against. Yeah, really good positional attacks uh, from Spargo with the back ears, but that F tilt going to clean out that stock. And right now, Spargo's sitting nice, only at 60%. Elegant's going to be looking to kill this. Honestly, I don't know if he could have gone for the up B out of there, but uh, didn't get it. Oh, OK. Oh, Spargo off stage. How's he gonna make it back? Erda just threw the down tilt. Another dash attack. Elegant off stage, and even the extended hitbox of that because of the green uh, the fireball did it looks, not hit it looks him. Looks like it delayed him. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so there we go. Spargo's first stock finally falling out of the game. But Luigi had already at 110%. Wow, good ledge, ledge trapping there from Spargo. Yeah, these platforms help to mix up like what he's doing at the ledge too, so very good. His F tilt almost killing. So kind of like the first stock. Right now, this is where this is where Elegant needs to start uh, putting in a lot of percent. Especially, I mean, he's almost at, he's basically at zero percent. So this is where the grab combos are most potent. Also have to roll up the out of shield once again. Yeah, you can't count Elgin out here. Uh, Spargo's still at low percent, so one grab could do a lot of damage and yeah. it back up. Uh, good job on Spargo reacting with uh, the up the out of shield. Yeah. And that's already 40%. He's already lapped him. That's the second time that that happens, where Luigi Cyclone saves Elgin from getting punished super hard there. Yeah, um, it's actually a really good uh, move. It's Wow. Wow. He just ran up and did it. <laughs> yeah, he stopped right before, like right out of Luigi's range, calling out uh, that Elegant was going to do a Nair and just F smashed him for it. That was very good placement and like good call out on what Elegant, Elegant was going to do. He, he knew that Elegant was going to react with a, with a move. He pressed a button and then uh, got forward smash for it. All right, so Elegant, can I take a little a breather right there? I'm getting right back into it. We have uh, Yoshi's Island. Up out of shield. There we go. 18%. I wonder if this stage helps Luigi with the uh, with the grab combo. Because uh, I know the stage is slanted a little bit. So I wonder if it makes it easier or if it would make it harder to I, land I feel the like, up I feel like the curves definitely could make it easier, but it could also make it worse, depending on which direction he's on, you know, right, yeah. part of it. Wow. He almost got killed Fireball again. saving him from that F-Smash. Uh, Fireball, you know, very underrated, apparently. <laughs> if it's saving you from F-Smash, it's very underrated. Right now, Spargo again at a lead. This is a big difference from the winner's side set, where Elegant was three-stalking Spargo. Yeah, this uh, first some game, Spargo two-stalking him there. Yeah, this is some adaptation we're seeing. Another up the out of shield. Uh, Spargo is really good at that. I was playing him in friendlies, and normally I like pressuring on shield, and I just couldn't because he just kept up being on reaction. Oh, I thought we were going to see an up right there uh, to punish Spargo's. But that's he's dead. Yeah, that's dead. Good, good fares coming yeah. from, from Elgin. So it started off with Spargo with some, uh, some momentum, and uh, Luigi just going to clutch out that stock before he loses his first. See the ledge trap, and that backer is just always going to beat out a fireball. And then, I mean, yeah, you can't really recover with a fireball off ledge against uh, a sword, right? Yeah, it didn't look like Elegant was going for that much. So, uh, good experimentation there, but it definitely wasn't worth it because it did cost him. Uh, yeah. Not sure if that cost him the stock there. 
It goes. Uh, it's the same thing with like the Belmonts. If you try to jump off ledge with a fireball, you're gonna get hit with a, a forward tilt. That whip's gonna just push you off stage, and you're gonna die. Right. Yeah. All right. And you saw earlier. You saw Spargo confirm. Uh, was it a blade beam into cross slash? That's crazy. Yeah, he, I've seen him go for it a couple times. It's actually very, very good. It looks yeah. very flashy, too. And lots of percent. So it's definitely worth the flash. Oh, yeah, it is. A, just the side B alone is a lot of percent. Yeah. Right now, Spargo's hitting 140%. Got another back here. Elegant is so tricky with those pivot grabs. It's, it almost feels like you, like you can hit him, but that pivot grab is actually pretty, uh, pretty big. It reminds me of uh, Bowser's. He can't get grabbed. Can grab. Yeah, Spargo can't get grabbed right here, or else yeah. he's gonna eat a lot of damage or a stock. Oh, that sucks. He keeps uh, Luigi keeps falling out of his uh, uppy. Oh no! Oh, <laughs> he almost job. got yeah. grabbed. Good job on Spargo. Uh, barely avoiding that grab. Look at that. What is that just, angle? It's just angling downwards. I've never seen that. Hmm. Yeah, I've never seen that either. <laughs> Oh, maybe that's you know, a that's a good thing for this character. I'm sure you can throw the uh, limit blade beam down that way too, which is gonna be something Elegant has to be mindful. That's of. true. That would be really sick if we saw a kill like that. Yeah, Spargo can't get grabbed right here. Good job on Spargo going uh, past the platform there. Yeah. Good job respecting the cyclone. Yeah. Uh, didn't get a punish for it though. Look, another up out of shield. Really good uh, reaction from Spargo. Oh, it makes oh, it no. back. But Forced to burn the limit there. Yeah. Oh, wow! I've never seen that down throw into cross up down smash. I think that only worked though because really because of the up. slant. I think he was trying to call it a, a directional air dodge in, but it still worked. Yeah, elegant definitely using his brain there. Yeah, uh, a lot calling, of mix ups. Yeah, using using those mix ups. Oh no, this is not looking good for Spargo. Oh, oh air dodge perfectly to ledge. Okay, yeah, Spargo just it's like his it's like his thing. It's his signature move there. Spargo with the up out of shield. Wow, that forwarder was so hard to punish. You actually couldn't really punish it unless you parried. Good knowledge from Spargo. Just do it. Oh. Yeah, he called the roll a little too early there. Uh, yeah, I think charging it too, uh, too much would have been through the middle. So. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, oh, and he's dead. Yeah. Wow. I think that slant helps as well, you know? Yeah, I'm not too sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure the slant may help there. Because if you were to throw someone downward and it's a slant, it sends them more at an angle outward, you know, like that. Right, yeah. I, I'm not sure, though, because it's, I mean, probably I, I wouldn't be too sure. Yeah, that's true. Either way, uh, good recovery from Elegant. Now it's 1-1. So uh, definitely did not want to go down 2-0 there. But back to Battlefield. This is a stage that Spargo is definitely liking. Yeah, I think, I think on Battlefield, uh, Cloud, just Cloud in general, uh, uh, having those platforms on the sides there can make uh, back air pressure just a little bit more uh, oppressive. Um, and then good job, Spargo, continue, continuing to use that up the shield. Really effective, very quick. Oh, and he hasn't been able to get any of these downers at ledge. I used to see that a lot in Smash 4, but uh, it's not working out right now. Oh, and that good back wait, air. Good wait on that air dodge. Yeah, I thought we were going to see a nair scoop him backward, but yeah, that back here going to work as well. Oh my god. Great back. just got plunger into down air. I, I've seen him do that uh, a couple times to some top players. I saw him do it to Tensora. Um, and it's just really good at gimping. It's just really good at stuffing out jumps and recoveries. Yeah. Uh, Elegant de definitely making really good use of that. He still gets the grab there. Dash Spargo's putting in work. He another, does the same thing. Another air dodge back here. Elegance definitely has to be a bit more mindful of that. Yeah. Yeah, it is costing him the stock, though Luigi's not uh, that good off stage, so I don't blame him. So here we go. Is he going to the same thing? Ooh, that's a gimp. Yeah. Wow, okay. Yeah, that was very risky, though, because if Spargo wanted to, I'm pretty sure he could have gone for an uppy suicide up if he suicide. had enough frame advantage. Yeah, well, either way, we're back to... Even stocks last, well, last stock yeah, and zero percent. Yeah, can, cannot get grabbed here. Oh, taking that damage is fine. I, uh, yeah, they're usually, even again. <laughs> right. Usually, usually against uh, Luigi, you just want to play anti grab at zero, and then uh, take whatever damage, whatever other damage you get from Luigi, uh, so that you don't, you can avoid that zero to death. All right, so Spargo's gonna Good need to play safe here. Oh wow, almost breaking your shield. Did it, I'm surprised I didn't poke. 
A good roll away. Oh, is he dead? It? Yeah, oh, wow. that's just so... Barely not making it. That's so barely good against that. Cloud. He just down tilts that ledge, and if it hits, he's dead, no matter what. Yeah, Luigi really good at covering the ledge there. Um, I'm seeing Elegant optimize the uh, plunger, using the plunger to co just cover more options on top of using down tilt and down air. Um, yeah. Really good offstage pressure. From Spargo looking a little flustered from that down tilt. It seems, I, I, I feel like it's very, it's just the fact that it seems so easy for him to just get edge guarded like that. Yeah, that was a really good comeback from Elegant. We saw the first few stocks just being taken away early with that back air. Yeah. See what Spargo's gonna do here to, to adjust. Um, oh, nice grab. Are we gonna oh see no. the kill? Is this He's on the top. Oh, no, that's not gonna do it. Yeah. He was on the top platform, though. That definitely would've killed. Good wait from Spargo. Another Double good wait. wait. Let's yeah. go. Very important to wait versus uh, Luigi, which ma makes him a very scary character because you have to respect him. Uh, when you feel you have a true combo, uh, that Cyclone just says no. Yeah, so you have to make sure it's true or you just got to wait sometimes because he's going to break it and sometimes that, that move kills you. Yeah, it's just really tricky. Good stuff on Elgin using it very... Yeah, good shield poke. You saw we placed that back here right onto the Luigi's head. Here you go, he's off stage. No edge guard, the blade beam like just barely been, missing. Yeah, it looks like that could have been an air. Yeah. Wow, you saw Elegant was trying to go for that forward or just to gimp him uh, like that. Good but job on Spargo going for the preemptive of the... Yeah, perfect uh, definitely timing. Definitely catching off, uh, throwing off his timing. Wow, just... Fireball stopped his dash attack and he just upbeat him. Wow, just... Oh All right. my god, and then Spargo responding with an up smash. Yeah, these guys are going back and forth non-stop all day today. Yeah. And these these games are looking very close too. Yeah. Okay. Oh no, this is not this is not good. Oh okay, no. that's a lot of damage. Wow, I can't believe. You know, I didn't. I wouldn't have reacted to that. But he's oh, no punish. He gets wow. punished for it instead. What did he do? What did he try to do there? So Spargo tried to up air him, but instead of hitting him with up air, he landed right in front of the shield. Wow. Um, and then Elegant, uh, very instinctively, just reacting to that with up B. Yeah. Really good. Uh, Punish from Elegant, just getting all that damage and then following up with the up out of shield. Yeah, and that's one thing about Luigi, you have to always watch out for. You do not want to have a lot of lag in front of his shield. Because yeah, if you do, I mean, that up out of shield is even more potent than the one that uh, the Cloud has. Spargo's yeah. been using it a lot more, but that up W from Luigi is so much better. Yeah, you have to be very careful versus Luigi. Um, I think after this uh, most recent patch, uh, Luigi's just been a beast. Uh, that invincibility on the Cyclone. Yeah. You know, the, the few buffs he got make really putting him on the map. Elegant uh, really proving it, proving it to us all. Mm -hmm. So right now, Elegant is up 2-1 in the set and only needs to take one more stock to take the whole tournament. Yeah. So we're going to need to see some big moves from Spargo. Right now, he's got the devil's number. But he's going to try to take the stock. <laughs> okay. Elegant really uh, timing that air dodge. Good down smash, uh, catching Elegant's whip on that grab there. Uh, I wonder what Elegant's going for with that plunger. It looks like he's trying to... I'm not too sure what he's going for. Oh, Spargo's oh, no. dead. He's going to die. Yeah, I think... Oh! Yeah. Wow, I wonder what that was. Good stuff to Elegant taking Wednesday night fights. Yeah. What Wednesday night fights is this? Oh, uh, the number you mean? Well, I mean, I don't think that matters. Good stuff to Elegant taking Wednesday night fights. Yeah. Uh, it looked like a very solid 3-1. Uh, Spargo doing very good.